everybody, it's the Snail Justice, and welcome back to some more Super Mario Galaxy 2. And, um, I am a little mad right now. Um, well, I mean, like, I'm getting over it, but, like, I'm mad because, like, my recording equipment, aka my phone, um, like, kept falling over and over again, and it was really, really annoying. But I finally got it, I, like, did something to it that made it better. Like, it had to do with the way that it was actually set up, so, yeah. And I know, like, we just, like, you know, like, jumped right into, like, a new galaxy. Well, this was the one that I was talking about that I really like. It's called Beat Block Galaxy. And it has pretty much, like, the funniest name ever. It's called Step to the Beep. Well, more like, when I was, um... When I was younger, like, it, to me, it was really funny because, like, to me, like, it would be, like, step to the beep, like, you know, it was, like, a bad word or something like that. And I used to, like, laugh at it all the time. But it's, like, one of my favorite galaxies, mostly because it has this, like, whole, like, you know, switching platform thing. Now, this is, like, a perfect exam example of platforming in a video game, so, yeah. And, um, I think this, this galaxy is unlocked by the Hungry Luma, like, I, mm, like, I tried to, um, do it earlier, but then my recording equipment fell down, and then, like, you know, I can't really, like, show me, like, feeding the Hungry Luma, so, yeah. Um, so you got a star from that, step to the beep. You got a star, step to the beep. Beep block galaxy, you got a cop metal. Got some star bits. Got some. You got one coin. So, wait, do I? Do I actually? Oh no, it's mail toad. Okay. All right, I have a letter for you. Oh well. Ooh, it's this one. Okay. Challenge race, race, racing at Wild Wide Galaxy. Don't chicken out. Don't chicken out. Come on, don't wait, don't wait. Okay. Come see me next time. There's a mail delivery. Okay. So, we have a challenge in Wild Glide Galaxy, so it looks like we're going to have to go back there. Uh, okay. Because, like, my Wii Remote acts weird sometimes. I don't know, like, what, what it does. And, well, we're going to be doing this right now. Just going to scoot over with my chair. Okay, this episode might be a little short, but it's for a good reason. Um, I'm not explaining why, but, like, meh. Okay, so, ju Jungle Fluzzard Race. Yes. We do have, a, we have to race against the other birds. Like, we just have to beat them, really. We, there's nothing, like, you know, we have to do or, or anything. Like, um, how we had to race through all those, like, goal things or whatever to get the Comet Medal. Uh, yeah, sure, let's race you. Shut up, shut up, this is being me doing, I don't know. Okay. Here we go. Two, one. Ding! I don't know why, but I just love this music. It's so good. So I just love it. Oh yeah, I'm totally winning right now. I'm like, I'm in fourth. Third. Okay, so here we go. Nothing special this year. It's just, you know, a grown man hanging on to a bird. Nothing, nothing really. Nothing really special. Okay, so here we go. I'm coming for you, um, whatever your name is. Oh, boy. Almost died there. I'm coming after you. Bad boys, what you gonna, what you gonna do when the bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do, what you gonna do when they come for you? Yeah, that's right. I just said that. I just brung that up. Boy. Okay. Uh... Come on. You can do it, Flazard. You can do it, Flazard. One minute and two sec. One minute and three seconds. Best time. I I lost? I'm no leader. You be our new leader. New leader. Now get to the thingy. Okay, so it looks like we got a. Well, obviously, we got a power star from that. Um, yeah, two stars. Two stars already. In just four minutes, no, about five minutes. 
So, you gotta start! Yeah. Oh, and it looks like we're here. We might, like, get one of those birds, like, just hang out around the ship. You gotta start! You gotta start! Jungle Flustered Rage, Wild Guy Galaxy, Galaxy Complete. Looks like one of your pals joined us. Also, they brought us one. I see you brought us back a really loud bird this time. Har har. Teehee, that's so funny. Yeah, hear that tranquil song, the stars? No? Well, it's tough to hear with over that jibber jibber thingy. You know, like, yep, it. Okay. Game's been saved. Okay, so looks like we are now going to be doing that rolling, like, you know, with the ball and everything. Um, I don't remember if it's our first time doing this, like, with the ball. I don't think it is, but it might be. Okay, can I zoom out? Can I zoom out? Thank you. Now oh, we gotta go here. We actually, we're probably going to be doing the, um, Bowser level, you know? Okay, so rolling masterpiece galaxy. This kind of seems like something that would be in the final world, but nah, it's not. It's just some kind of rolling thing. Silver Chom Grudge Match. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This is our third star. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and there's 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 the Silver Chomp. Yep. And you probably already guessed like what? How are we gonna get the star? Pretty much just have to throw him down. Yeah. I know how to ride, Billboard. Hey, it's me, Billboard. If you want to ride on this star ball, listen up. Okay, first thing you do is jump onto the star ball. I'm pretty sure I know how to do this. Alright, so you made it on board. Now take the thingy and hold it straight up like this. I know. I know. That's it. Think of, think of that as your last of your starting position. From that starting position, tilt thingy to start rolling forward. Okay? Use thingy to jump. Then you also swoosh things on your way. Enough chatter though. New thing rolling. I know I'll do this. I'm a trained professional. Obviously. Okay. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of that one, like, green star in Super Mario Galaxy 2. Oh, there's the key that we need to get. It reminds me of that one green star. Um, I don't remember what it's called, but it's like, it's this rolling ball galaxy. Not this exact rolling ball galaxy, but it's a rolling ball thing. And I don't know why, but this, well, I mean, it only has, like, something that's very important with the two of them. Oh, boy, yep, see, told you I'm a trained professional. Yeah, yeah. Wait, I don't think I need a cut, because there's a checkpoint right there. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, boy. Okay, we're good. We're good. Wait, what's over here? Is this a Comet Metal? No, it's just a one-up. Just, just a one-up. Just a one-up. Okay. Got some Goombas here that we need to squish. It's fun doing that, because they pretty much like go into the ground when that happens. Oh! One thing about this that I have to mention, I'm a trained professional. Okay, so one thing I wanted to mention about this part right here is that it was brought back in um, Super Mario 3D World, and it is like so easy because all you have to do is touch the gamepad screen and pretty much all of it just, oh uh, no, oh I got it. Pretty much all of it just, you know, comes up. Like all you have to do is touch the Wii U gamepad screen and then voila. You got it. Oh yeah, I like a boss. I'm so trained. Awesomes. Oh no no no. No no no. Oh no 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 no. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so pretty much every time I die, uh, whether it's on this level or not, I'm gonna say I'm a trained professional. I'm gonna do that in future videos too. Like whether it's this LP or whether it's a different one. Okay, you died. Awesomeness. That's great, awesome. That's great, Mario. You did it. Ah! I have to put down there. It didn't really look like it was 3D. It just looks like the other things. You gotta, you have to climb a pool to get it, though. 
Oh, look, Mario. Nice. You're a pole dancer. Da, da, da. You got a star. So ten minutes into the video, and we have, we have, couple, we have, yeah, we have only three stars. Well, I mean, I guess that's a lot for no uh, ten minutes. You got star so Trump grudge match, rolling masterpiece galaxy. You got a cop medal. Got some star bits. You got some coins, like two or something. Oh, yep, yep. There's, there it is. Told, told you that there's the. Uh, I knew, I told you that the Bowser's levels had, you know, the comets. A thingy, Lars, just a thingy, baby, Luma's arrived. Do my last Luma, I won't worry about your friend, helpful, and, you know, stuff. Wow, well, there's 50 servers attached to this level. Wow, 50 servers attached to this level. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that happened. 50 servers attached to that letter. So, um... I think the, we're gonna do one more star, but it's that one that just appeared. So, it's probably, I think this is like one of those speed levels, you know, those speed runs that we have to do. So, yeah, that's the Junior Fiery Flotilla. He's got Comet, you gotta do that, Comet. Wheel Pranks are contacted! Fiery Flotilla speed run. That was really Cyber Flotilla. Yeah, I think it's like a small portion of it. Like, obviously, you don't have to fight. Oh, yeah, you do have to fight the boss. Yeah. But you just start at the boss anyway, so it doesn't matter, really. Arnolf! <laughs> and, of course, he has a scar under his chin. Okay, can you, like... Go in the ground now, so I can like hit you and stuff. Go in the ground, Mr. Goyo, Goyo Ding. What's his name? I don't remember what his name is. Okay, we already got three of his little thingies, whatever that is. I don't really know what they are. We're just like something. All right, so lots of star bits we got. We got lots of star bits. Yeah, this is probably going to be the last uh, star that we do for this episode, guys. Four stars isn't bad, but, like, I'm going to Yoshi Master 1026's house later today. And, um, so, yeah, I have to, like, wrap it up pretty soon. I have to get that. Don't tip me in the face. Yeah. Oh, no, he's going in the ground. He's going to eat the ground. I always, been, I always wanted to ask you, Mr. Um, Gobblegut, that's his name. Um, how does dirt taste exactly? Ah, dang it, come on! Like, I always wanted to try it, like, obviously, but, like, I never really knew what it tasted like, so... Like, I just have to ask you, Mr. Gobblegut. Oh, no, it's in the ground now. I just need to get that one little thingy on him. Yes! Okay, he's dead now. Okay, bye-bye. Oh, he's got his light. There's light coming out of him. Poof. I think he's dead. Because he obviously poofed into nothing. So that obviously means he's not dead. Duh. Like, come on, guys. Seriously. It's a 44 star bits and one star. Um, actually, we can do one more. We can do one more star, and it'll be fine. Okay. Yeah. Galaxy complete. You got some star bits. You got some coins. Oh, and there's another comet. Okay. Rolling Masterpiece Galaxy. Okay. Well, that's gonna do it for this episode of Super Mario X2 Part 14. Um, I mean, I could have done that other star that just appeared, because I, I, I have a lot more time, but I can't, really. So, yeah, um... Leave me on the job, Mario! 
Okay, guys, um, that's the end of the video. I guess I'll just see you guys next time where we'll be doing that comet thing in the Bowser level if there are no more comets. So, I guess I'll just see you guys next time.